Hi, how are you doing today, Jill? Pretty good. You doing okay? I'm good, thanks for asking. Um, my name's Kara, I'm a nursing student, and I'm just here to do a quick baseline assessment on you. So we're just gonna check for, um, we're gonna do about a head to toe assessment really quick. It's just gonna take a couple minutes. We're just, um, I wanna see where you're at right now and just kinda, so we can get a baseline at the beginning of our shift. Okay, do you have any questions for me? No. Okay. Um, how are you feeling today? Are you are you feeling okay? Is your yeah. mood okay? Are you feeling anxious at all? Or are you just calm and content for a little bit? I'm, I'm good. Are you doing okay? Yeah. Okay. Um, can you tell me your name and your birth date? Uh, Jill Ashcraft, October second, two thousand one. Okay, good. I would check on your your band there. Um, okay. Do you have any um past medical histories? Any kind of illnesses? Any family history? Anything like that? Be aware of. Um, no. No. Okay. Any present illnesses? Anything that's going on right now? Um, I mean, not really. I mean, I have a slight headache. A little bit of a headache. Okay. Um, do you have any allergies? Any environmental allergies? No. No. Okay. Any um medical allergies? Allergies for any medications? Things like that. No. Okay. Are you taking any medications? Um, I've been taking Tylenol. Tylenol. Okay. Yeah. Um, so you're saying you have a little bit of a headache. Is that what brings you in today? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, on a scale from one to 10, one being, um, no pain and attending the worst pain you've, you've had, where would you rate your pain right now? Um, probably a two or three. A two or three. Okay. So not super high, but it's, it's definitely there, right? Yeah. Okay. Um, can you tell me a little bit about the pain? Any characteristics? Is it like a sharp pain or just kind of a dull? It's pain. Kind of a dull pain. A little bit of a dull pain. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um when when did your pain begin? Um like five days ago. Five days ago? Okay. And um you said that you're in your head, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh is there a place, a specific place in your head that it's, mm -hmm. it's kind of kind of all, kind of all over? Right. Okay. Um and is it a constant pain or does it kinda of come and go? Um kinda of comes and goes. Go, comes and goes, okay. Um, does it, is there anything that you can tell that makes your pain worse? Um, no. <laughs> no, okay. Um, is there anything that makes it better? Um, laying down. Laying down, just kind of relaxing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Does it radiate anywhere? Um, uh, down my neck a little bit. Down your neck. Okay. Um, as, do you have any other associated symptoms? Any like dizziness, nausea, vomiting, anything like that? No. No, just the headache. Just the headache. Okay. Um, all right. Well, I'll have you follow me in here. Um, I'm adjusting the room for safety. No cords or wires that are in our way. I'm gonna shut the curtain. Give us some privacy. Okay, Jill. Um, you already told me your name, but can you tell me where we are right now? Um, we're in Ephraim. We're in Ephraim. Okay, where are you from? I'm from Santa Quinn. You're from Santa Quinn. Okay. Um, can you tell me what day of the week it is? It is. <laughs> I think it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. Tuesday. Okay. Yep, you're right. Okay. Um, of what month? September. September of what year? Uh, 2020. Okay. Can you tell me who the president is right now? Biden. Okay. Good. All right. I was just discussing your level of consciousness. Um, you're oriented times three. Everything sounds good there. Okay. I'm going to hurry and take a look at your vitals. We took them a little earlier and we took your blood pressure, your pulse, your um, respirations and we did your oxygen saturations and everything looks good okay um all right do you have any other questions for me right now and we'll just kind of get started I think we're good. okay all right first i'm gonna i'm gonna look at your eyes okay so i just want you to look straight ahead at me i'm gonna shine this light in your eyes care good okay good can you watch the tip of my pen all right, good. So I was just um, making sure that your pupils are equal, they're round, they're reactive to light and accommodation. So everything looked good. Okay, can you watch the tip of my pen again? And I want you to keep your head still and just move your eyes, okay? Okay, good. All right, um, next I'm just gonna feel your head. I'm gonna feel for any tenderness, any um, indentations, things like that, okay? All right, any pain there? I'm gonna move down to your neck. Can you open your mouth for me? Good, and close, look at your neck here. Okay, um, every, 
looks good. I'm gonna have you stick your tongue out and say ah. Okay, good. Look up your nose <laughs> as well. Okay, are you having any troubles hearing me? I think I think we're making good conversation back and forth. Any yeah. any problems there? No, no you're doing okay. Okay. Um, oh, that's not my pen. That's okay. Um, <laughs> all right. Um, okay. Are you having any chest pain today? Any problems? Um, here, I'm just gonna um, inspect your chest and I would kind of palpate here for any pain or tenderness. Okay. Any discoloration? Everything looks great there. Okay. I'm just gonna listen to your heart. Yes, I was getting it all. <laughs> Thank you. Sorry. Okay, fine. Okay, um, I'm gonna listen in about five different places. I'm gonna go over each place twice, okay? So I just want you to try and relax for a minute. Okay, so I'm gonna listen to the aortic first. Just this one for right and rhythm here. Good. And pulmonic. The herbs point. Okay, tricuspid. Okay, and mitral here. Okay. All right, now I'm gonna go through again with the bell. Once again, this is the aortic. Okay, pulmonic. Herbs point here. Tricuspid. Good, and the mitral. Okay, all right, I'm gonna listen here for one minute, okay. about 76 which is good because we want that to be a thing between about 60 and 100 so we'll be good there hey um are you having any problems breathing any respiratory distress shortness of breath cough no. any pain there are you doing okay yeah okay all right next i'm going to listen to your lungs i'm going to listen in about 12 different spots on your chest here okay okay so i just want you to take some deep breaths in and out through your mouth okay i'm going to start kind of up high here okay whenever you're ready Okay, so far your lungs sound really clear. I'm not hearing any um, crackles or wheezing, nothing like that, nope. Okay, so I'm gonna have you um, 
front foot's the wall here. And we're just going to do the same thing. We're going to listen on your back. So just more deep breaths um, through your mouth. And I'm going to listen in about 20 different spots, okay? Okay. Your lungs sound really good. They sound clear. Oh, good. I know. We'll just crack with the weeds and we'll be happy with that. Okay. Um, next, I'm just going to feel your arms, okay? So I'm just palpating for edema right now. I'm checking skin color, integrity, muscle tissue temperature. So the pulse is here. Good. I'm going to pull bilaterally. Okay, I'm going to feel your skin here, just assessing for turgor, so just the elasticity and hydration of your skin. So I need to get another popcorn too. Okay, all right, um, can you squeeze my fingers? Okay, so I see your fingers here, checking for a capsule refill. Should be under three seconds, which is perfect. Can you push up on my hands? Good, not pushing down. All right, okay. um, I'm gonna do the same thing for your legs here, okay? Feeling for edema, temperature, assess skin, um, color as well. Can I have you take your shoes off for a minute? Yeah. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. All right, and I'll have you. Yeah, yes, please. For just a second, I'll have you lay down on the bed. I'm gonna sit my head up for you, okay? Your knees are coming up too. It's gonna fold you in half. <laughs> Put those knees down in a second. Okay, good. All right, I'm gonna feel your pulses here. Good, okay, right here as well. Okay, all right, and I would check for a capillary refill as well. A little slower, but your, your toes are a little cold here. Okay, I'm gonna have you bend your knee up. Okay, I'm gonna have you push it against my hand. Any pain through here? Okay, on this side. Against my hand, any pain here? Okay, can you push down on my hands here? Okay, not push up. Okay, good. Um, okay, I'm gonna lay these flat on your back. And I'm just gonna listen to your abdomen for a minute. Can I have you pull your shirt up just a little bit? Yeah. So I would inspect the area first. Okay. I'm looking for color, any wounds, any abnormalities, anything like that. Then I would listen to each of the four quadrants. Listen for a brewy here. Okay, I'm not hearing anything. Just good. Okay, um, and I heard digestive through noises in all four quadrants. I'm just gonna um, lightly push down on your abdomen and you let me know if it's tender or any pain or anything like that. Okay. okay. Any pain there? 
Nope. Hey, all right. Hey, next. Um, when, when was your last bowel movement? Um, switch up again. This morning. This morning, okay. Um, was it normal for you? Normal in color, consistency, no constipation or diarrhea, anything like that? Yeah, nice. Um, what about urination? Everything normal for you? Um, no itching, burning, irritation? No. Okay, color is okay. Yeah. And um, no odor, anything like that? Okay. Um, how's, how's your diet been? Have you been eating enough? Uh, fruits and vegetables, things like that. Probably could eat some more. But. <laughs> <laughs> Please, well, um, can, <coughs> excuse me. Okay, uh, are you trying to eat about three meals a day? Mm -hmm. Eating regularly? Okay. Yeah. Um, could you give me like a proportion of what, maybe a percentage? Um, <clears throat> of what? All of it. All of it, 100%? Okay, yeah. perfect. Um, you're drinking, oh my goodness. <laughs> Sorry. Um, drinking enough water throughout the day? Okay. Um, all right, um, I would assess if you had any tubes, drainages, catheters, any oxygen, anything like that, if you had an IV, which you don't, I would check the site. I would make sure that it isn't infiltrated, which means that the fluid is um, leaking out of the vein and into like the surrounding tissue it can cause some um, inflammation and irritation there. I would also check for phlebitis, which could be a possible blood clot um, underneath the surface of the skin there and it would leave some red streaks up your arm. More redness, irritation, inflammation, that kind of thing. I would, so I'd assess the site, I'd assess the gauge, I'd assess um, the fluid, make sure it's the right fluid and the right rate. Um, I would just make sure it's not um, occluded, everything's running smoothly that way. Okay, and I didn't see any wounds when I assessed your skin. Um, so nothing there, but if you did, I would assess the wound type, I would assess the dressing that was on it, I would assess maybe the location and how big, I would look at the drainage, um, the color, and odor if any, and anything like that. Okay, let me just think for a moment, moment of anything I, I missed or anything you could go over again. Okay, nothing that I can think of. Okay, so I'm gonna go get you something in for that headache. Is there any other questions for me? Anything else I can do for you? No, I think we're good. Think you're okay? Hey, thank, thank you. you.